Anthony from Seattle, and I'm here just to kick with my guys over in uh, Vegas, obviously. Are you keeping that deliberately vague? Uh, I am. <laughs> I I really am. Okay. How can you? How could you tell? <laughs> well, then we won't ask any more questions about that. Okay. Let's go with an easy one. Who did you vote for in 2016? Uh, take a wild guess of who I voted for. Uh, Gary Johnson. Uh, the name doesn't sound familiar, but if that's who you think I voted for, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, who did you actually vote for in 2016? I didn't vote for Trump. And you didn't vote for Gary Johnson. So Bernie. You voted for Bernie Sanders. Bernie and, the, and then Clinton? I don't know. I really don't know. God, I don't know. Shit. I think he's just playing. This guy's way smarter than he lets on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So do, but you, you've never heard of Gary Johnson? No. Okay. So there's this whole other political party in the United States called the Libertarian Party okay. that nominates a president yeah, every four years. Yeah. yeah. He was yeah. a Libertarian Party nominee. Okay. Does it bother you that you hadn't heard of him? Kind of. Do you watch the news? I do. It kind of bothers me. I mean, I want to get more more involved in politics, but at the same time, it's just like, shit, I mean, I don't really got time to. I always tell myself I'm going to, like, read up on politics, know who, like, who's running, what they're running for, and what they hold represent. On but hold on a do, do you pay taxes? I do. You have a regular paycheck job? Yes. Yeah. So, so you pay how much in taxes as a percent? I, yeah. A lot? Yeah, uh, yeah, I do a lot. I put him on the spot too much before this started. I mean, you gotta you know, relax. You know, you know, I, you know, I pay a lot in taxes. I just don't want to, you know, admit it. Yeah, yeah. Well, because yeah. you, I mean, if you if you are paying say like even twenty five percent in taxes, right? Yeah. That's like you're working for government a quarter of the time you're at work, right? Basically. Is taxation theft? I believe so. So they're stealing from you. And you don't have time to figure out why or what you could do about it? I mean, I feel like I can't really do much about it. I feel like shit ain't gonna change, honestly. Shit ain't gonna change. Like, I mean, I could try to make, put my voice out there. I could try to make a difference, but at the same time, if the government wants their money, they're gonna get their fucking money. How many Americans do you think feel like you do? Majority. And so if all of them said, fuck it, we're gonna do something about it because we're being stolen from every damn day that we're working, you think something would change? I think so. Yeah, I think so. So what you're saying is, well, like, my voice could make a difference if we all came together, right? Obviously. And there's a place where we can overthrow the duopoly and say to the Republicans and Democrats, you're not going to mess with us any longer. You're not going to steal from our paychecks. You're not going to start wars in our name. You're not going to tell us what drugs we can and cannot do. You're not going to tell us where we can and cannot live. You're not going to tell us what we can do for work. You're not going to tell us how to live our lives. We want to be free. Does that sound like something you would be into? Definitely. I mean, it's, it's, that abortion shit, bro. Like, I know I'm changing the subject, but that abortion shit that dude just passed, that's bullshit, bro. It's bullshit. Like, I was reading some story about some 11-year-old girl who was raped, and here she is, you know, a child fucking having a baby. I'm God, cuss, I that's right. I'm sorry. But a child having a baby, bro, and she's not ready for it. She was raped. That's fucked up, yo. So, yeah, so I feel like any voice out there, any voice that can be represented, whatever, like, I feel like it's definitely worth speaking up on. Like, everything that you just named on top of that abortion shit, bro, for real. Like, All right, well, would you start by going to LP.org for Libertarian Party? LP.org, seeing what we're all about, overthrowing the duopoly, and consider joining? Definitely. Like, seriously, bro, like, if I could do anything in my voice out there, yes, I will. Awesome. Thank you so much, brother. Anthony, that's beautiful. Thanks, Adam. Yep. Appreciate you, y'all. Yo, thank you. Adam versus the man is made possible by people who care about freedom, like our Patreon supporters whose monthly contributions get them perks and exclusive content. Find out how you can help by going to patreon.com slash Adam versus the man. Adam versus the man is made possible with support from Smart Cash. Check out smartcash.cc to find out more about this powerful business focused cryptocurrency that is fast easy to use and community centric smart cash is designed to be securely used for day-to-day -day transactions and put the currency back in cryptocurrency